When you're just starting out with your own e-commerce business, it can be hard to figure out exactly where to focus your attention. Should you start a Shopify dropshipping business? Or should you do affiliate marketing? While there are pros and cons to both, for many new entrepreneurs, affiliate marketing is a more attractive option. Let's take a look at why that is. Nowadays, there are lots of people who want to sell products online but don't want the hassle of dealing with inventory and shipping. If you're one of those people, then Shopify dropshipping is perfect for you. Set up an account and choose some products from their catalog and they'll take care of all the rest. But if you're someone who likes being more hands-on with your business and wants complete control over what products your store carries and how they get to customers' doors, then maybe Shopify dropshipping isn't right for you. It may be better instead to focus on affiliate marketing. With Shopify dropshipping, you don't have to worry about the inventory, shipping, or anything else. You simply create a store on Shopify and choose whatever products you want to sell. When someone buys your product, Shopify will order the product from the manufacturer and deliver it to your customer. You get paid when the product sells. Shopify's dropshipping fees are calculated as a percentage of your sales price. They range from 2% to 15%. But if you use Shopify payments, the fees will be 2.9% plus 30 cents. Dropship stores can get pretty pricey. Though the basic Shopify store plan costs $1.29 per month, but most people upgrade to a higher plan, $1.79 slash month, and some even pay $1.299 slash month for extra features like unlimited bandwidth. With affiliate marketing, you'll set up an affiliate website that promotes products from another company, usually in the same niche. You'll then receive a commission each time someone follows one of your links. Affiliate marketing is a method of making money by selling other people's products or services. You use your website or blog to advertise their products and or services. If someone visits your site and then buys something from it, you get a commission for that sale. The biggest difference between online stores and affiliate marketing is how the business model works. Online stores sell physical products of their own, while affiliate marketers promote other people's products and services. Both can be very profitable business models if you do things right. Another difference between these two business models is the initial investment required to start them. To start an online store, you will need somewhere to host your store and buy inventory to sell on your site. This can easily cost several hundred dollars or more when all is said and done. On the other hand, it costs almost nothing to start an affiliate marketing business unless you spend money on advertising, which is optional. The only real cost is buying a domain name and web hosting for your website, if you don't already have it. Those two things combined usually cost less than $100 per year. Dropshipping might be better than affiliate marketing if you are not interested in creating your own content and would rather just redirect traffic to other people's content. You want full control of your business and don't want to rely on third-party suppliers. You are interested in selling physical products instead of digital ones. Affiliate marketing might be better than dropshipping if you enjoy creating valuable content and do not mind taking your time to build an audience that trusts you, since this will take time, probably months or years. You are more interested in selling digital products or services instead of physical ones. You like having multiple sources of income instead of just relying on one main income source from dropshipping. When you're just starting out with your own